I'm going to be a witness whether I'm bringing this project or I'm allowing this project or I'm supporting this project to come and grab the people of Lango. Makerere, where we went to school, also those people sacrificed their land. The sugar, the sugar which we are taking in our tea, also the people of Busoga, they sacrificed their what? And you find it very funny. Our own, the castle laborers, they are crossing up to Lukasi, up to Jinja, to go and labor in what? Sugar plantation. And right now, the device is going to be the truth. Most of our people are going to be engaged in the castle labor from what? This area. And that's very beautiful. I must we shall work with the political leadership to ensure that the line of power that we extended here, the proximate communities, benefit out of it. We shall further ensure, again working with the political leadership and the relevant ministry, we request that we lobby to get a health center in this place. If we are able to get that kind of clearance within the provisions of our budget, we shall set aside a budget to construct that facility. Uganda has lagged behind for the last many years because livestock had been left intact. But now that we are moving into the direction of livestock, I'm very glad actually we are going to change so much because <coughs> we have the highest density of herbage the amount of grass per square meter in the world. We are the only country, when you sit down here, you don't see soil. 100% pasture cover. But when you ask how many animals eat the grass, zero. So we have a big task as a research institute to convert this natural resource God gave us into beef, into meat, into eggs, into every livestock resource product. We had no such facilities here. This land has belonged to government for a long time, but it has been uh, vacant, it has been encroached, it has been uh, misused and abused, and it has not helped us. So we welcome uh, that decision of government to relocate here with all the facilities, uh, the, all the programs that they will bring in terms of uh, animal breeding, in terms of um, entomology and uh, vaccinology. So we hope that it will transform the lives of our local people, of our farmers. We keep a lot of animals here. Um, we also need jobs for our local people, for our young people. Some animals are outside. <laughs>